Hey there, guys. This is Dave Wood talking to you from my home in the mountains in Costa Rica. This is my this is my dog, Messi. Hey, Messi, how are you doing? This is all the people out there on the internet. Uh, she is our, our uh, second family member, of course, after me, my wife, and I suppose my wife, and then the the, the puppy. But we named her Messi because she's constantly making a mess, and she's whining off in the background. So if you hear a little yelping and whining, it's because we're not paying any attention to her. And she is one spoiled dog. Yes, you are. Anyways, that's my dog. Today, folks, I'm going to teach you something profound. I'm going to teach you, in fact, something that, that's so secret that if you apply it, not only will you make more money in your business, not only will you triple and quadruple and multiply by 10 the amount of traffic that you're getting, but you're going to do it with less work. How do I know this? Well, when I first started on the Internet, I operated under this principle where I really thought that the way to do this was kind of to do all the grunt work myself. I thought I should make my own videos. I thought I should write all my articles. I thought I should do all my backlinking. I thought I should do everything. And then, after a while, I started making a lot of money. You know, a couple months in, I was making uh, $5,000, $10,000, $20,000 a week. And I was like, well, I've never made that much money in my life. And so I said, well, rather than doing it all myself, why don't I pay for somebody else to do it? If I can pay them 5 or $10 an hour, then I don't have to do it, right? And that was phase number two. And then I learned the mystical, magical key, the mystical magical <laughs> key to success. And that is getting other people to do that stuff for free. Now that's what I'm going to teach you today because that is what social traffic is all about. It's how to create what I call viral sustainability. Now some of this stuff is easy to get. Some of this stuff you, you got to be a little bit of a genius or a guru or something to get. But I promise you that if you do what I say You'll make more money, you'll work less, and you'll just have a better life. All right, so how does this work? Well, essentially built around the principle that you know everybody talks about on how business should grow. Business should grow by what? By word of mouth, right? By people talking to people, talking to people, talking to people. It's the best way to market. Most people, they don't build businesses like that, though. They build businesses to where they have to do it all themselves. And they try to get referrals, they try to get other people talking about it, but for some reason, nobody actually talks about it, so it winds up being all them. They say, well, I'm going to have people refer me to others because I give such great service, and for some reason, the people don't. But then a great movie comes out, Transformers comes out, or Avatar comes out, or something where, where they've got this new 3D technology in town, or a new bar opens in town that's just the best place to party, or something fun happens, and all your friends and all your relatives and everybody around you is talking about that fun thing, or Britney Spears, you know, gets a divorce or something like that, and then everybody's like, ooh, Britney Spears got a divorce, and they're talking about that, but all this whole time, they're not talking about your dang soap and vitamins business. Now, why? Well, the reason why is because in, in human psychology, you've got to look at the reasons why people do things, all right? Why do people do stuff? How come Facebook has, you know, 600 million active users today? How come this stuff happens, whereas somebody going out there talking about a business, talking about an opportunity, saying this is how you make money, this is how you get other people started, this is how you get rich on the Internet? Well, those people are out there, and they're talking and talking and talking. It's like people join, they pay to join, and then it's hard to get them to talk about it. The people over at the free thing, at the movie, and all this other stuff, they talk about it with, with completely no volition, whereas when you're talking about a business, they stop talking about it, and you've got to go, go talk to your family, and they don't. So why don't they talk to their family in a business setting, and why do they talk about it in usually free settings like Facebook and social media? Well, here's why. Because there are reasons why people share naturally, right? And as long as you understand why people share stuff naturally, people will share your stuff without you having to do anything. All right, now, this is the question that you've got to ask yourself. If you're out at you know, a bar or a party or you're around friends or you're really around your family and you're not down to business, right? Because when everybody's talking about business, what do they do? They, they fold their arms and they roll their eyes. They don't do anything, right? If you're around your friends, your family, all these things, right? You don't really talk about business, do you? What do you talk about? You talk about, this is what people do. They talk about what's interesting, right? They talk about what's fun, right? And that's kind of it. 
people don't naturally share things that aren't interesting and fun. So here's what I'm going to suggest to you is, is phase number one. I'm going to tell you a little story here of where I got this, and then I'm going to actually show you how to do it and how to make the metrics of it and the math of it work. All right? I got started in my business, and it was all serious. I mean, if you could imagine me today, I, I mean, I haven't cut my hair in a year and a half, and, you know, I just like to travel the world. And honestly, you know, I, I don't even, I, you know, I don't shave for days at a time. And, you know, I, I work in my underwear and stuff like that. Great picture in your mind, isn't it? And, and I, I stumble around, and my English isn't always perfect. And somehow I'm making ridiculous gobs and gobs of money, right? Well, when I started, I was all serious. And it wasn't my personality. I got started in my business, my, and my sponsor told me, this is business, and business is serious. So I walked around kind of force-feeding my business on people. And then I learned it didn't work so well, and I got on the internet and I started marketing. And I learned that if I put these messages that didn't work when I was running around chasing people in an environment where I could get them in front of thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of eyeballs daily through creating content and sharing on the internet, I learned that if I did this, that it still worked. But then I started making lots of money, thousands of dollars a day. And I started questioning everything I did. And I asked myself, does this matter to my success? For example, one of the things that's a long-term held notion by business people is you got to wear a suit and tie to be successful. And nobody really says it like that, but they do. You ever been to a meeting and they say, if you want to be successful, you got you to wear a suit and tie or people won't take you seriously. You know, you got to wear the you know, red tie means power, right? I was at an event with a speaker, great guy, and he proceeded to tell me the science of why he was dressed in a certain way and how it's been studied in multiple studies being dressed this way relates to the most amount of people. And then I proceeded to outsell him at the event by three to one, wearing no shoes and a shirt that said the amazing MLM guy. And I, honestly, I hadn't washed it in two days, and I wore it every day I was at the event. Now, how did I do that? Because I started casting off notions that other people thought were important. And I got down to the bare bones and the grassroots of what is important. And what's important? What's important is your business sells stuff, right? What do you want people to do if you have a business? You want people to buy stuff, don't you? Well, for them to buy stuff, you got to sell stuff. To sell stuff, what do you got to do? Well, number one, you got to be good at selling or have somebody else that is. And number two, you got to get a lot of people to see it. But here's the key is getting people to see it. See, because you could be worse at selling, right? But if more people see it, more people will buy lots of stuff, right? Whereas if you're really, really, really good at selling and you talk to two people a day, you're not going to sell too much stuff now, are you? Right? So you want lots of people to buy stuff. Does that make sense? Now, to get people to buy stuff, what do you need? You need lots of traffic, right? Here's what I learned. I learned that traffic is like a gateway on the internet. Let me explain how the mystical magical key works, all right? This is, and I promise you, this is the mystical magical key, and I'm going to show you how this all fits together to get, just make you more money you've ever made in your entire life. And some people are being folding their eyes and say, Dave, get to the meat. This is the meat and the potatoes, and I'm going to give you the gravy here in a second. So let me explain how this works. The mystical magical key is this. To sell stuff, because remember, you want people to buy lots of things now, don't you? You want them to buy the blogging system. You want them to buy the Inner Circle membership. You want them to buy the Costa Rica Mastermind Intensive. You want them to buy the 15000 per month formula, don't you? At least if you're in already, you do. So this is the way that it works. You've got a presentation, all right? And usually a presentation or a sales letter, right? What's a sales letter? A sales letter is one of those long letters with testimonials and things in it that somebody reads and then they decide to buy, right? You want a presentation and a sales letter to be seen by thousands and thousands and thousands of people. Not a few people, thousands, all right? Like if you look at the, for example, the $25 per month blogging system. If you're on the blog right now, of course, watching this video in the boot camp, you're going to see those tabs there on the right. You've all watched that presentation if you have it. I encourage you to do that now. And if you watch that presentation, of course, you're going to want to buy it, right? Well, you want a lot of people seeing that presentation. You want a lot of people looking at your primary business. You want a lot of people picking up the phone and calling you because they're interested in what you're doing. The way you do this is by getting thousands of people, if you can, thousands, as many people as possible, as many people as possible watching your presentation. The more people you have watching your presentation, number one, the more money you're going to make. Number two, the better your presentation sells, the more money you're going to make. Let me give you an example of that. 
If you have a presentation that's really typical, it converts at about 2.5%, that is industry average for about everything, you're going to make X amount of money. However, if you've got a presentation that now all of a sudden converts at 10%, you say, well, that would multiply my income by 5, wouldn't it? And the answer is no, it actually multiplies your income by about 30 or 40, because all the metrics of your entire business change. So number one, you've got to get lots of people to see a presentation. Number two, your presentation has got to get people to take action now. And by taking action, I mean they buy lots of stuff, right? So this is exactly what you have to do in your business in order to get results. And then the next thing that you need to have happen is you need as many eyeballs as possible to watch that presentation. But here's the problem with that. Nobody wants to see presentations. Nobody. Nobody cares. Nobody wants to see an Amway business presentation. Nobody wants to see an Herbalife business presentation. Nobody wants to go to a hotel meeting. Nobody wants to see a commercial, do they? Do you turn on the TV, and this is a good question to ask yourself, because this is apparently a lot of the way people act in network marketing. Do you turn on the TV, my friend, and you're just sitting there waiting on the TV, and you turn on the TV and you say, I cannot wait for the commercials. Probably once a year when, when the, uh, you know, watching football, <laughs> right? But other than that, you don't, do you? You watch football, and then why do you watch the presentations? Why do you watch the commercials? You watch them for one and one, only one reason. Because if you don't watch them, you can't see the movie. See, people go to the movie, and by virtue of being in the movie, they are forced to watch the presentations inserted along the way. Most people in this industry, they screw that up. They're constant presentations, and they're never a movie. What do I mean by that? They are boring, boring people. Always talking about, let me explain the five keys of selling stuff. And then they explain the five keys of selling stuff. And then they say, well, now let me explain, since I've explained to you the five keys of selling stuff, let me explain to you the five keys being more motivated. And you say, let the five keys be more motivated. And then the next day they come out and they say, let me, let me explain the five keys of direct response marketing. And after a while, you get sick of seeing commercials, right? But here's what everybody wants in the world. Everybody wants to be involved in things that are interesting, that are fun, that make them feel good, that make them feel empowered, right? And here's the key, if they keep coming back, they keep being interested, they keep feeling good, they keep being empowered, they keep learning new stuff all along the way, here's what happens is your commercials get seen exponentially more because if they are not interested and they don't feel good, they are not going to want to buy stuff like, of course, you do right now. Now, here's the key to doing that, is you want to build your traffic not around your presentation. You want to build your traffic based on being interesting, fun, empowering, and informative. And then people will naturally gravitate towards seeing your presentation more. For example, haven't these last few videos just been a tad bit entertaining? Well, there's a reason why I do that. They have to be 85% inter in entertainment and stories and 15% or less information, or you will not keep watching them. Sometimes people come to me, the analytical folks, and they say, Dave, I, I got you, I got you, I got to learn to tell stories, I got to learn to do this, but can you please make the video shorter, and can you please just give me the facts? And the reality is no, because if I do that, you won't buy nothing, right? However, if I instead focus a majority of my presentation on communication, on explaining the reasons why, on expressing stories and connecting with you, and all of a sudden you start feeling good, what happens is you go back and you watch the presentations over and over and over and over and over and over again looking for the secrets. So let me explain how I discovered this. I used to be serious. And it used to be hard to get traffic. I used to go around getting backlinks and doing all this SEO stuff that I'm going to teach you over the next couple of webinars. But I used to do on-page optimization, off-page optimization, submit thousands of backlinks out and do all this stuff. And then I realized something. I realized, well, I've been developing this email list and this community and these people who like to watch my stuff. So I wonder what would then happen if instead of doing that, what I decided to do was goof off. So I made a video one day out here in my yard. I was actually running around. My hair was wild. I had scruffed out hair with like five days of growth on it. I looked like a crazy man, and crazy indeed I am. And I started running around my yard out here screaming and yelling about the government, holding the camera, and it looked crazy. It kind of made you sick watching it. And I was just ranting and yelling about everything, about how I think government's too big and taxes is too big and screaming and yelling. Right now, here's what happened. I'm, now, I'm a little bit crazy, and you say, Dave, all right, mountain man, slow down just a little bit here. I'm a Democrat. Well, that's fine if you are, because 
I want to help you make lots more money too so you can pay even more money to taxes or whatever you want to do. But here's the reality that happened to me. I made this video and I put it on the internet and I thought there was going to be 5,000 pages of comments that says, Dave, you are a fool. But you know what happened? Is all the crazy, right-wing, religious, fanatical type people, even though I was cussing and I was screaming and I was swearing and my hair was all crazy, they thought the video was so ridiculous that they just wrote pages. It was literally pages and pages and pages and pages of comments on this government video. I got like 500 leads in five days from a video yelling and screaming about the government. You say, how'd that work? Because the people who would be watching that would be wanting to learn about the government, right? Here's why it worked. Let me explain it to you. It worked because everybody wants to be entertained. Everybody does want to be informed, but they want to do it in an interesting way. But here's the key. When they are, they want to see what you got to sell. So you know how much money I made from that stupid government video? It was about $10,000. Now you say, Dave, how in the world, now this wasn't my intention, but really I was just yelling and screaming about the government and how I'd love to grow weed in my yard if I was allowed. But here's the reality, folks, is I made this video, I was yelling and screaming and being entertaining, and people were like, I can't believe he said that, and they just hit like and they hit share. And I got, it was like 20 or 30,000 visitors to my site in a week from a stupid video talking about the government. Well, here I used to slave away for a trickle of traffic from people finding me in a Google search. You say, how's that work? Well, it's the same principle by which Facebook makes all their money. Let me explain how this is, and then I'm explaining to you exactly what to do, and you're gonna get excited about that when I do. Now, here's the reality of what you got. You got Facebook, right? Let me actually get my little towel here, because remember, this is a gangster setup, and I live out in the mountains of Costa Rica. You say, Dave, how did you start a company that did $2 million in sales in its first 50 days with a ratted out towel like this and this gangster setup? It's because people don't care. They just want to be entertained and buy stuff. Everybody likes to buy things, don't they? So here's the reality. You got Facebook, right? And you say, Dave, Facebook gets lots of traffic. How can you compare anything to Facebook? I'm not comparing to Facebook. I'm explaining how they make money. So how does Facebook make money? They offer you a service for free. And what's that service? It's all a social stream. You got your photo over on the left. You got a social stream. You got an ability to post updates, right? You got all the little things and all the little video games you like to use over at Facebook. And then you got these little ads at the side. And Facebook gets you to generate all the traffic. And how do they do that? They get you to share stuff that people want to see. You ever notice if you go spam links on Facebook wall and you say, here's my business, 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 here's my... People don't want to listen to you, do they? However, if you're entertaining all the time, if you're social all the time, and then occasionally you say, hey, I want you to check something out. Everybody goes and they swarm to look at the link that you put up because you're never one of these spammy trashers out there. You just put out interesting stuff, don't you? Just like when you hit like at this video, which you're welcome to do at any time you choose. Now, here's the reality. They go over here. Now, how does Facebook make money from this? You ever ask yourself that? They do it by selling your information to the advertisers who put little ads up here. Nothing wrong with that. And then the advertisers target you based on the interest that you fill out in your profile. And then the advertiser are then targeting the traffic that Facebook creates and extracting money from your sphere of influence like mad scientists. Now that's pretty cool. I'm going to teach you about that when I talk about PPC a little bit later in these videos. That's how Facebook makes money is by selling your information to advertisers. Don't you know that? Right now they don't sell lists. They sell ad space. And they have the opportunity to put ads to extract the traffic out onto their list and those people go into their funnel like I talked about in the previous videos and they sell stuff and make lots of money doing that if they're any good. Right, Dave Sharp? Brilliant at this. Right? So that's how Facebook creates its money. Well, what if instead of doing this, which this is fine too, by the way, we're best site integrated with Facebook on the internet in this niche especially. But here's the reality. What if instead of doing this, you created all this traffic and all the ad space you didn't own, you had a scientific sales funnel that extracted money from people like genies in a magic lamp. Now, that's exactly what we do here at the Empower Network, but we do it, of course, for you. So your job then is to create the traffic. Our job is then to help you extract money from that traffic, and all you got to do is just get in. Just get in. Just decide to take action. Just buy the stuff. Just buy it all. You say, what should I buy? Everything, of course. <laughs> I'm going to say that, of course, because, of course, I'm selling it, right? Even though I don't even make money off all the purchases in the organization. I just make money by helping lots and lots of people get lots and lots and lots of money every day. All right, now, let me explain this to you so real quick. So this is the concept that drives Facebook, social traffic. Call that ST, social traffic drives Facebook. You ever notice how people will pay exponentially more, more attention 
to stuff that is interesting, to news, to noteworthy things, than they will to people talking about business all the time. Why? Because nobody wants to hear it. Nobody wants to hear it, folks. Nobody wants to hear about the five secret keys to making money. There's 1% of the population that gives a crap. The rest of the population want to drink beer, watch TV, eat donuts, be entertained, and get lots of money for doing nothing. Now, that's unfortunate because, of course, you've got to work hard to get lots and lots of money, even here, if you decide to join. But the reality is, folks, is that this situation, right, you're trying to market to less than 1% of the population. Well, what's the problem with that, folks? Would you rather sell the 99 out of 100? Or would you rather sell the 1 out of 100? I'll tell you what, the 1% are more interested in. They're more interested because they're smart in a way to sell to the 99%. There's a saying that goes like this. This is by a guy named Dave Severn, who actually is one of my one of my kind of surrogate speaking mentors that I used to drive around and listen to audios in the car back in the days, Amway. Dave Severn is one of these Amway guys, been around for like a million years, and he's hilarious to listen to, talks about pigs not stinking all the time. But here's the reality with Dave Severn. He said something fascinating. One time in a meeting, he said, there's two ways you can make money. Now, really, I think there's only one way to make money. I'll get to that a little bit later on. But he says, there's two ways to make money. Way number one, you can serve the classes and live with the masses. So what does that mean? Well, serving the mass, serving the classes, what do you do? You get a job and you get money from your boss at your job, right? You go out there and you have some kind of job that you do for somebody who pays you. That's called serving the classes. Why? Because they're making money from what you're doing. Or you can serve the masses and live with the classes. What would you rather do? I'd rather sell to the 99% and the 1% any day. And how do you do that? Well, they want to drink beer, watch TV, drug, sex, rock and roll, and make lots of money, right? And how do you reach out to them? You do it by being interesting, right? That's why I'm so off the chain. Now, I'm off the chain a little bit, too, just because I'm a little off the chain, right? But one of the reasons I am and one of the reasons why I'll say shit in a video in the business space is because people say, I can't believe he said that. He's in business. And then they giggle and buy lots of stuff. Isn't that fascinating, right? Which you're welcome to do, by the way, because this whole thing is only $25 a month. I mean, I'd just, I just get in uh, and buy the blogging system right now if I were you, immediately, uh, if you haven't done it. You're welcome to do that. There's probably a little buy button in the video, because I'm clever with things like that. I just take action, just buy stuff, and that'll go to whoever referred you to here, referred you here, right, last. Whoever your last referral was in the Empower Network will get 100% commission for that, for that month. Now, so be entertaining, and here's the key. People will want to watch your stuff and buy stuff and be around you, even friends and family, if your stuff is not boring, right? If your shit don't stink, in other words. All right, now let me explain to you exactly how this works. Okay, so people do a lot of things naturally all the time. Like, let me give you an example here real quick. People do things, for example, like they get these little chain emails, right, with five pages of funny pictures. You ever got one of those? You get a chain email. It's five pages of funny pictures, all right, and everybody's emailing to their friends and family. Now, also, I'm sure you've gotten an email that says, watch this video, and you go and you click on it, and it's a riot that happened in Europe somewhere, right? And you're like, oh, my gosh, and you comment on the YouTube video, right? Or you take all the pictures and all the photos and everything like you got like that, and then you, you, you email everybody. You say, you got to see this. You got to look at this. I know I've seen government stuff. I've I've seen videos politically, I've seen inspirational things, and I've just shared the crud out of these things. And then one day, I had this idea. I said, what if every time I did that, rather than putting it somewhere where somebody else makes money, like YouTube, what if I just took that same video and I just put it on my site, and then I sent my friends and family to the site, I said, you got to look at this video. Well, what I discovered is not only will they still watch it, not only are they not offended because it's not a business message. You ever talk to your grandma, you're like, hey, grandma, I got this special deal for you. It's only $49.99 a month. You can make money on the internet with me. And she's like, I'm your grandma, son. Right? Well, I discovered that they don't do that if you send them to that funny stuff, but you just put it on your own site rather than putting it somewhere else. So here's what I'm going to encourage you to do. Step number one is every time for the rest of your life, now you might think this is stupid, right? But I'm going to explain why this works together here in a minute. Every time for the rest of your life that you come up with one of those funny videos, that you just take the embed code off of YouTube, because YouTube loves it, gives them, gives them some backlink love, and just pop it in your Empower Network blog, and then send it out. Now, people are still going to go to it. You can write your thoughts and your information. And here's the key, is your friends, your family, your list, they're still going to watch that funny-ass video, right, that you think is hilarious, 
except for they're going to drive traffic to your blog, except for you own the ad space. So something that you do every day that would take less than 30 seconds, as an example, you don't do it every day, but once a week we all do that. We pass something along funny to our five favorite contacts, except for now you're doing it to your thing where you control all of the ad space here at Empower Network and where you earn 100% of the money, and you're not even selling something. So if they say, well, I got on that website, someone sold you, you say, yeah, isn't that guy a jerk? And you kind of chuckle to yourself, right? You don't even have to do anything, right? Does that make sense to you? You don't even have to do anything. Just take what you already do, transfer it. So rather than being entertainment and giving somebody else all your money, be entertaining and give yourself all the money, right? Just pop the video in here. It'll pop up in the blog post. Super easy to do. We explain how to do in the Fast Start videos in the Empower Network if you buy the $25 blogging system, which I encourage you to do, of course, right now. That's step number one to do is just every time you do something for the rest of your life, put it on your own site rather than somebody else's site. And other sites love it because it gives them backlinks, gives them love, right? I encourage you to always credit other people's work, too. If you're taking some content from a post somebody else wrote, always link back to their post. Give them some backlink love. Because guess what? You'll actually get more traffic by doing that. Okay, so that's step number one. <coughs> Here's the key. You've got to get traffic like people like to get traffic. Now, after I discovered this, I discovered a magical, mystical formula. There's actually two parts to it. And it's going to be a little bit confusing, but it's actually pretty simple once you see it two or three times. So you might need to watch this video two or three times just to be entertained and, of course, you know, uh, you want to give yourself plenty of opportunities to buy all the stuff on the site and keep coming back here and sharing your thoughts and writing comments below. All right, now here's what I'm encouraging you to, here's what I learned, all right? I learned that I, there was this viral formula for getting traffic, okay? Because here at Empower Network, for example, you own the ad space. If somebody clicks on one of those ads, or they, they click on one of the ads, they fill out one of the opt-in forms. If you refer to them, if they came through your traffic, through your articles that you created, right, you get the leads, right? You get the traffic, and if they buy something, you keep all the money, right? Because our comp plan is 100% commission, so you keep all the money. So if they're buying the bogging system, you keep $25 a month, right? If they're buying the inner circle, then you keep $100 a month, right? It's 100% commission payout model. We'll do the selling. All you do is do the, get the traffic. Super easy to do. It just takes a daily habit, right? And you keep all the money. Not fair. All right, so this is, this is the way it works. So they're going to come here, and you're going to leads, traffic, and money. Now, I had this little breakthrough because somebody heard me talk about this social traffic thing, and then they just started blogging about the top 10 subjects in what's hot in Alexa. If you go to Alexa.com, you can download a little toolbar there to keep track of traffic on the Internet. I encourage you to get that uh, so you can look at all the sites and what, who gets traffic and who doesn't. And there's a thing called the, the hottest things on Alexa. And he just started taking things and, you know, blogging about Lindsay Lohan and all these celebrities and all the hot things on Alexa. And he actually got 20, started getting a 20, 30 leads a day just from blogging about famous people and all the gossip and things that are happening. Why? You say, Dave, those people aren't even interested in making money. Yes, they are. They're just not interested in dumb, stupid, boring business crap. If you show them a way to make money where they don't have to be retarded, oh, they're in. They're in yesterday. Where they don't have to be Donald Trump. They don't have to be this big superstar celebrity. They just friggin' hang out, drink beer, make money, or whatever it is that they're in. Maybe they're not into beer. Maybe they like sit around reading the Bible or something. Whatever it is they like to do, they're making money. That's what they want. So everybody's interested in it. So we can target way more things than network marketing and online marketing, all this boring crap everybody else talks about targeting all the time. Right? But here's the reality. You start getting 20, 25 leads a day just by blogging about famous people and dumb stuff. Isn't that cool? Now, here's the key. Here's what you want to do. This is called the virally self-sustaining formula. Okay? Virally self-sustain. Sustain. There's a few steps in it, and you've got to follow them, and it's a daily process that's going to take you from 90 days to a year to really get effective at it. And there's a couple of steps that you need to do. Number one, you need to blog every day on our community site, blog daily. And I'm just telling you, friend, you are going to get more traffic from us than you will if you try to do it on your own. The reason is because we've got 10,000 blog, as of making this video, this is two months in, we've got 10,000 blog posts a day happening on the site. You cannot get as much traffic on your own domain as you can on a site that's getting 10,000 blog posts a day, period. So blog daily every day for at least when? The next 90 days. You say, Dave, I don't want to blog daily. Well, you know, some of those days, take a dang picture of a famous celebrity and obviously give credit to where you got the picture from because you don't want to break people's trademarks. Link back to their site. Give proper credit where credit is due. All right, but here's the reality, folks. Blog daily about whatever you're interested in and share it with people that you know. Right now, don't share the boring stuff because some of you are going to go out there and say, well, I'm going to learn SEO wizardry. Your friends are not interested in it, okay? So if you're blogging about crap, 
don't, don't put crap on your Facebook wall. Put interesting stuff on your Facebook wall, funny stuff on your Facebook wall, really informative stuff. Here's the key. Every time you do something really good, something really informative, and you can do that with our blog post here at Empower Network too, okay? because you can actually use these, you can actually add your affiliate code when you're an affiliate to any post we do. You can use my stuff if you want, right? Or you could use your stuff, and this is the way that it works. You can add question mark ID equals, and then your username to the end of any post. Now, usually we have that actually in the bottom of the post on how to do that. Super easy to do, and if you refer somebody via that link, you're gonna make sales from stuff we do, okay? But here's what you do. You're going to start getting leads by being consistent, blogging, and sharing as long as you're not a boring a-hole all the time. You'd be a little bit, just not all the time. All right. Then you're going to start getting leads, and you're also going to start making sales. Right? Now, here's the key. When you get leads and you make sales, email that list daily. Email them every day. You say, Dave, what do I email them to? Do I email them sales videos, affiliate links? What do I do? Leave the affiliate links out of them. We're going to do a scientific upsell process to give you affiliate money, in addition to what you make here at the Empower Network. Plus, we're going to help you sell whatever business that you're in on the back end. If you're in another business, if you're not, we'll just help you sell whatever you want to sell, coaching or businesses. We've got lots of opportunities here to, for you to open up your creativity. But we're going to help you sell your stuff. You're going to keep all the money. But here's the key. You want to email that list and those members every day back to your blog post here at the Empower Network. Now, we actually have an emailer where you can email all your customers in the, in the members area. So if you have customers, right, of our products, and this is counts for customers and affiliates, right, they're different. If we have customers of the products, you can email them if you're a member here at the Empower Network and communicate with them with those messages. Now here's what's going to happen, is as you start making sales, you're going to start building up what we call a tribe, your own tribe, right? And what does a tribe do? A tribe is a team of people that band together to do something, all right? And it's a team of people that gradually will start listening to you. And if you email them daily, what's going to happen is a certain percent, not all of them, it's going to be like 5% of them, or 10%, or maybe even 2%. Mine is like 5 or 10%. They are going to look at their email box every day and hit refresh waiting for you to send them an email, because they'll be so excited to hear from you. And it just happens with every personality. Why? Because I ain't an engineer. Right? Some engineers will see me there and go like this. Some will see me and they'll chuckle. I can't believe that guy makes any money at all. Right? But the reality is we all relate to different people. Right? Does that make sense? So you're going to have a percentage of your list that relate to you like crazy. And you need to email them every day because what's going to happen? When you email that list, remember, you're building the list from blogging and you get the list up here and then you email the list every new post that's interesting, not the boring trash, but you email it. And then you take that list, you tell them to connect with you on Facebook, you tell them to connect with you on Twitter and all these places, you give your links to them in every email, and then you tweet it and you share it. What's going to happen? You're going to build this tribe who comes back daily and comments on your stuff. So we have these little FB comments here, the Facebook comments, and we're going to have other comments here you can comment with too. But here's the reality, they're going to comment and they're going to say, hi Dave, I really enjoyed this post, and then that comment is going to post on Facebook and they're going to build up their social network and their social circles, and that is going to bring traffic back to your site. So the act of building a community and building leads automatically, by its nature, creates what I call virally self-sustaining traffic. One lead turns into five leads, turns into 15, turns into 150. I've been doing this now for two and a half years. And here's the badass part about virally self-sustaining traffic. Google can't take it away. Facebook can't take it away because it's your tribe that you built. It's your social community. And nobody can stop people from talking about something if they want to. Here's the key. They will talk about you if you're interesting. Now, there's two styles of good marketers out there, generally. And I'm going to encourage you to combine the styles. What's style number one? Hard-hitting direct response. You get them and you sell them. More like Dave Sharp. Till he actually he met me. Right? And I was more just goofing off over here. I was more on this side to just get people to come back all the time and sell them stuff on the back end. Best combo, bring those together. Why? Here's why. Because here's what happens when you have hard hitting sell stuff all the time. Here's what happens. Your email open rate and your spam complaint rate go like this. Right? Spam complaints go up, email open rate goes down over time. So in other words, your list, let's say you've got 1,000 leads and you're getting 10 leads a day, 
Your list, let's say, is going to have about a 30% open rate when you start. That's going to even out around 20% if you're interesting. It'll stay there. But if you're not interesting, if you're boring all the time, here's what's going to happen, is gradually over a period of a year, since all you talk about, all you talk about, all you talk about is please buy my things, please buy stuff, here's the next thing to buy, here's the next product launch, here's the next affiliate thing, blah, blah, blah. guess what's going to happen? Is that open rate is going to go to 2 to 5%. And this is where almost every internet marketer in the world is today. Why? Because nobody wants to read boring business stuff all the time. They want to be entertained. Does that make sense to you? Right? Yeah. And what happens when you have a 12 to 15% open rate rather than 2 to 5? You make 6, right? 5 to 6 times the money from every email you ever send because more people will read your stuff. Isn't that fascinating to know? So what you're doing then is you're creating a community of people that will keep coming back and a lot of them won't even ever buy stuff. A lot of them won't ever get in. A lot of them won't ever make a decision, right? They're just going to keep watching, keep hanging out, right? But you keep emailing. We have that emailer back there. Also, your list is integrated. So if you've got Aweber, if you've got GetResponse, uh, we're going to add some other probably list providers back there. But right now, we've got those two right now. All right, Aweber, get response. If you can just put your list name in there, and we'll capture the leads for you. We've helped people generate, uh, since launch, actually, more than a quarter million leads in the last uh, 60 days, right? Uh, you keep the leads. You keep the member database. And you can email them and build your community, build your tribe, and we're going to do the marketing for you. Not fair. And you say, Dave, why would you do that? Because I want you to succeed. And I know if you focus on one thing, one thing only, that you're going to be successful. And this is how you do it. So blog daily, make it good. Don't put trash on the site. Don't put trash on any site. Make good stuff only. Good stuff will outperform trash 99 to 1. You know? It'll outproduce SEO. Good stuff will over time. Right? And here's the cool thing with us. We actually built in a formula, and this is the next formula of virally self-sustaining promotion. You say, Dave, where can I learn more about this viral self-sustaining promotion thing? Well, you can learn more in two places, actually, uh, uh, that, that <coughs> a few places, actually, that you can learn. Number one, you want to get in, you want to buy the uh, blogging system. It's $25 a month, uh, and you want to be paying for that every month, because this is how you play in your system. You actually need to be an active member of this to be able to earn commissions, uh, or you need to have an active customer of that to earn commission, all right? Uh, y you also want to be in $100 a month in the inner circle level. Why? Because we have inter interviews with our top people in the Empower Network that are really going to lay the secrets on you on how they're doing this, right? There's a lot of people on there. there you also want to buy the, uh, uh, the 15000 per month formula. It's a one-time payment of $250. You also want to buy the Costa Rica Mastermind Intensive. It's $500. And, of course, you want to buy everything we ever sell, just everything. Just get it all, all right? <laughs> you say, Dave, you just, just trust me. Just get all. Just, just pull out your credit card, buy everything. Just be, just be an adult. Just, just get it all. Just get it all, right? So here's what you want to do. In this, in this 15000 per month formula, there's about 20 hours of training, about give or take a little bit, right? So you say, Dave, it's only 19. I don't know how much it is, actually. It's about three-hour webinars. There's like six of them, and there's some bonuses and stuff. So it's like you know, 18, 20 hours, something like that of training. It's got a manual in it, all right? If you're seeing it after it's done, you might be seeing it while we're still doing the course. We're only on webinar four, so don't expect the manual to be done. But it's got this training in here, and here's the key. We talk about how to do this step by simple steps. You actually, you, you want this, right? Why, you say, Dave, why do I want the Inner Circle membership? Because this is going to be the ongoing inspiration. It's going to be the ongoing motivation, all right? It's going to be audios uh, uploaded to there two or three times a week. They're going to teach you how to get other people to buy lots of stuff, all right? So $25 a month is going to give you the system and the tools that allows you to do it for your business. You say, Dave, how is this helping me sell my business? Well, you can do one of two things. You don't have to participate as an affiliate if you don't want to. You're welcome to give the commissions to somebody else, or you're welcome to keep them for yourself. You, you don't have to be an affiliate here if you, do, if you just want to participate in our community, and we'll help you get more traffic. All right, but here's the reality here. We didn't give you the system that gives you the capture pages, that gives you the hosting, that gives you the design, that gives you the culture, that gives you the, the, the plugins, the resources, so you don't have to focus on tech. Just take the word technology here and just, just cross it off because you're not a programmer. You know, one out of a thousand of you are, right? The rest of us, are, you know, are retarded. So just take that out for a second. No technology worries whatsoever. We're going to help you get a merchant account. Why? 
Well, that's here if you're in the States, and internationally we're going to come up with a solution too, because it's a little more difficult to get people merchant accounts internationally than we thought originally. But we're going to help you get a merchant account here uh, in the States. We explain this all in the blogging system, in the Fast Start training, how we help you set this up. And then you're actually going to be making money directly, taking payments for yourself. Our payment page is actually your customers uh, that you sell our system and that our products and our tools to, regardless of whether they want to be affiliates or not, they're actually going to be pulling out their credit card, entering in their credit card details, and they're going to be setting up a recurring subscription to pay you directly $25 a month with no intermediate. So I would just buy that. Why? Because if you buy it, this is what I've learned. You say, Dave, do I have to buy it to make money from it? Not technically, all right? But here's the reality behind it, is I've learned that people who don't buy products that they want to sell, Right? Number one, I don't really think it's ethical in this industry because you're telling people to use something that you're not willing to use. But number two, I found that they have a difficult time just doing it for some reason. Because, of course, our product is the blogging system. Right? And if you don't have the blogging system, you're going to have to get this traffic somewhere else. Right? And you're not going to have access to any of our tools. You're going to have to do everything manually. Right? So the automation is part of this product. All right? And it just makes sense to buy what you're selling. Does that make sense? And that way you're ethical, you're in integrity, you're in alignment, because we believe in being ethical here. Does that make sense? Okay, so this is, this is, you should buy this, and you say, Dave, what's this Costa Rica product? This product will go into a dramatic amount of detail on how to create virally self-sustaining uh, systems, because we don't want you to just do it here. We actually want you to teach you how to grow and enhance it outside of here, and we're building in technology here at the Empower Network that allow you to capitalize off of what we do to help you virally spin out your businesses and what you do better than anything you've ever seen in the world in a way that's social, entertaining, that's fun, that people just want to be a part of, people just come and they hang out at because it's just badass. All right, that's what we're doing here as a company. All right, so what's, a virally, what's the last part of it? Here's the key. Now you've got your tribe is getting you traffic. Your tribe is getting you leads. I'm going to write this down. They're getting you traffic. They're getting you leads. But here's the key now. Here's what starts happening. You start helping your tribe succeed by leading an example that they can follow, right? Like Paul Hutchings did. Let me tell you a story. I started online. One of the first guys I sponsored was a guy named Dan. Dan got a guy named Paul Hutchings in another kind of a system. Paul Hutchings got in with me. Dan quit. So I should be flipping you. I'm not meaning to flip you off there. He was the second one, right? Paul Hutchings followed my stuff to the T. He's here in Power Network, made thousands of dollars here. He recruited 200 people in a year in his company. Never succeeded in network marketing. Went full time, supports his wife, his family, his kids, all through this, this business, this industry by copying me. So what's going to happen is if you lead by example, if you lead by following the eight core steps we talked about in the first one, by being at the events, by being on the conference calls, by plugging your team in, by blogging every day, by emailing every day, if you lead by example, Others will copy your behavior. They'll start to succeed over time. Because this does take hard work, energy, perseverance. It's just more simple. I really want you to understand that, folks. This, like anything, is a business. And as a business, it takes hard work. It takes energy. It takes creativity. It takes entrepreneurialism. It takes perseverance. Not everybody makes money. Okay? Only people who learn the skills, who put in the energy, who put in the work, who exercise the leadership qualities, who sell products and services make lots of money. I want you to understand that. So you don't have any delusions when you get started and take action. We want you to take action with the right mentality that I'm going to be here in a year and I'm going to make this happen. Because I understand that I'm not going to get 100% commissions like this anywhere else in the world. All right, But it takes hard work, energy, effort, perseverance. But here's the key. When you start doing that, your team sees he's being consistent. They'll start to follow and model you, and we'll help you do it in less than two hours a day. And here's the key. They're going to start copying it. And when they do, this is the next thing that starts happening. They're going to start making videos, writing articles about you. And you will have an army of people out there promoting you with no work. right? That's the last piece of the puzzle. Actually, not the last piece. It's part of the last piece. And when they do, you are going to get people who, you're going to help them out because they need something to write about by being an example of story. And here's the key. People are going to seek you out. And it's the best free traffic, and money can't buy it. Only success can buy it. Only an example of leadership can buy it. Only vision and perseverance can buy it. That makes sense to you. And here's the last part of the formula. When people quit and they 
stop paying 25 a month, you say, Dave, who's going to quit this thing? This is awesome. I just want to get in forever. Well, I want you to be in forever and feel safe here. But let's say somebody just decides to give up and quit on their dreams. And go, or they decide to go do something else. We don't want people to stay here who don't want to be here. Let's say they wrote 90 articles here. Well, guess what happens? Is you then, you get all their traffic. <laughs> now, their face is still on it because they could come reactivate it. They still own the content. They could come back in there if they just start paying again because it's a product. But you're going to get all their traffic. So essentially, it's like they just went and created all this traffic and said, you know, I'm not interested anymore. Here, let me give it to you. They're welcome to quit at any time. Isn't that great? Isn't that wonderful? Doesn't that just make you excited? Makes me excited. So here's the reality. What should you do next? Well, number one, be back here tomorrow because tomorrow, and it ain't going to be a specific time, this email's coming out. Just watch your email like a hawk, and if some reason you get off the list, just get back on the list somehow. Tomorrow I'm going to send you out a video, and I'm going to explain how to do SEO the ninja way. Now, I'm not going to get into a lot of the secrets. Why? Because a lot of the secrets are in the 15000 per month formula. I don't need to repeat it. If you want it, just pay $250, all right? And there's some bonus videos in there by my good pal, and all he does is do SEO. But here's the reality, folks. I'm going to teach you the core of SEO, why it works the way that it does. I'm going to teach you how to do it. I'm going to teach you how to get other people doing it. I'm going to teach you how, by doing it together, how we all get more traffic and leads. I'm going to teach you how I started getting 100 leads a day doing it. I'm going to teach you how I did it without even doing it. <laughs> Imagine that. But what you got to do in between now and tomorrow. Number one, decide that you're going to take action every single day for the next 90 days. Take the manual below this video. If there's a manual, and read it and apply it in your business. Study these concepts and principles, right? Buy all the stuff. Buy all the courses. You say, damn, I can't get everything. Well, then get what you can get, OK? Do what you can do. Stretch a little. Pay for your education. You say, Dave, what am I paying for? You're paying for your education, for the tools and resources that can help you succeed in your business, whatever that business is. You're paying to be a part of our syndication community, to get traffic from us to capitalize off of our hundreds of thousands of unique visitors a day is what you're paying for, right? My puppy is wanting some love and attention, so. A vast virus database has been updated. My puppy, this is what she's saying, my last thought to you. Don't be a wussy, just get in. Are you saying that, Matthew? Are you saying these wuss? She just says don't be a wussy. Just, just get in. Just decide that you're going to take action with us for the next 90 days. And <laughs> just, just, stop, just stop being a wussy, all right? And, and I'm going to see you on the beaches of the world because it starts with a decision that's where you're at right now. I'm looking forward to seeing you at the top of the Empower Network uh, and having thousands of people paying you daily for products they bought from you that you didn't even have to build just because you got a bunch of traffic. Isn't that cool? Can you do that? Can you make a post a day for 90 days? Can you take 15 minutes and take a Lindsay Lohan photo and write a little description of it and post it up on the blog and backlink it a little bit and share it with your friends and laugh and giggle, right? If you can, let's just do it. No reason not to. Why? Because the puppy demands it. The puppy just demands that you get it immediately. I'll see you on the top, my friends. Bye-bye.